uh welcome back friends and in this video let's start with this soft example and then later we shall discuss about the the avogadro's law um in this soft example we are saying according to our question uh liters of gas as a pressure for near statisini tall and a temperature of kumina saba degrees centigrade so given the volume is sana ishinatano Point nine liters. Pressure is equal to me a tall. And the temperature is equal to kumna saba degrees centigrade. What will be the volume if the pressure is changed to a part? Pressure is changed to 1.85 atm. So let's call this V1, then this P1. And this is temperature P1, this is pressure P2, and then the temperature T2, 345 Kelvin. Uh, required, required here is the volume 2, V2 is equal to. So sometimes you, you may name these as uh, initial volume, initial pressure, initial temperature, then final pressure, final temperature, and final, final volume. So, from the general gas equation, from the general gas equation, according to the data given here, general gas equation, when general gas equation, V1, P1 divided by T1 is equal to V2, T2 divided by uh, P2 divided by T2. Required V2. Okay, make subject V2 to part of V1, P1 divided by T2 is equal to T1 P2 this is equal to B is equal to T2 V2 like you know kujua hapa ni kwamba nitakio convert kwa mfano hii hapa we convert kwenda ATM au hii hapa end tall utakavochagua wewe na hii lazima uadi 273 iwe Kevin mfano hapo okay add 273 itakuwa ni kama 290 ah uh, 290 kevin so you see hivyo ndivyo ambavyo nitakio ulifanya hilo swali we are using the the normal general gas equation kwa naona hapo hapo ame convert ile pressure ame convert kwenda kwenye tall pamoja na temperature ame convert kwenda kwenye nani kwenda kwenye kwenye kevin hii hapa alivyo convert kwenda kwenye tall ndo kampata 1405 0.99 tall. Kwa hiyo mimi sina calculator hapa lakini if you calculate you will get the volume 2 in hiyo hapa. Now let's discuss about the Avogadro's law. Avogadro's law. Avogadro's Avogadro's law. Ah uh, naamini wengi ambao mlikuwa mna interest pia kwenye form 3 chemistry mlisoma Avogadro's law and to a certain extent you remember it. However kwenye a level avogadro's law ni ile ile na mwisho wa siku utakuja kupata kitu keke lakini ni kama kuna baadhi ya vitu ambavyo vinabadilika just ideas uh, first thing ni kwamba it is found experimentally that the amount of a gas in a mole is proportional to the volume that is volume is directly proportional to the number of moles when temperature and pressure is constant So this is the first law which explains Kwa hiyo hii ndo law ya kwanza gases ambayo inazungumzia relation kati ya zile parameters pamoja na number of moles. Unaweza kuona law zote tuzoangalia nyuma ziko na zungumzia just pressure, volume, temperature. Lakini hazijazungumzia number of moles. Na uki remove proportionality sign tunasema remove proportionality sign tutapata V is equal to A N. Ah uh, kwa nini tumeweka proportionality uh, tumeweka hii a badala ya kuweka k kama ilivyo kawaida hiyo ni normal tu just the letter so v divided by n will be equal to a uh, v1 divided by n uh, v1 divided by n1 is equal to v2 divided by n2 is equal to a so v1 divided by v2 is equal to n1 divided by n2 uh, this is the expression of the of the avogadro's 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 law so the 
the avogadro's law remain the same uh, remain the same and we are saying that from the avogadro's law from the avogadro's if v1 is equal to v2 then the same ratio should be on the right hand side n1 would be is equal to n2 according to avogadro's law thus for the equation for the equal volumes of two gases at fixed the temperature and the pressure the number of moles is also equal at fixed the temperature and the pressure number of moles is equal if the the volumes are equal this is the basis of the avogadro's law so avogadro's law is the same we are stating that equal volumes of gases at the same temperature and the pressure equal volumes of, of gases at the same temperature and pressure contain equal number of moles or molecules equal number of moles or molecules if the molar amount is doubled the volume is doubled so equal volumes of gases at the same temperature and pressure contain the same amount of gases equal volumes of gases at the same temperature and pressure contain the same amount of gas or sometimes we can state it as the volume of a gas is directly proportional to the number of moles at constant temperature and pressure. And now from there, let's move to the to the idea of the molar gas of molar gas constant GMV. Molar gas constant GMV. So let's see what is the molar gas constant GMV. What is the molar gas constant? Uh, it follows as corollary of Avogadro's law that one, one mole of any gas at a given temperature, T and pressure T, has the same fixed volume. So it is called the molar gas volume or molar volume. Kwa hiyo kulingana na avogadro's law ni kwamba one mole ya gas, one mole ya gas, any gas, any, inakwena volume flani V at constant T and P. Ko e gas one volume ya one mole ya gas ndio ikaitwa molar gas constant GMV molar gas constant is the volume of one mole of the gas one mole of any gas any gas at standard temperature standard temperature Above standard temperature ni sawasawa na 0 degree centigrade au au 273 kelvin 273 kelvin at standard temperature and pressure Above standard pressure ni 1 atm au 760 tol kwa hiyo you see gmv uh, ni sawasawa na volume of one mole of the gas at STP standard temperature and pressure STP manak standard temperature and pressure so in order to compare the molar volumes of gases chemists yani watu wa chemistry use a fixed reference temperature and pressure this is called standard temperature and pressure STP the standard temperature used ni mambi 73 K Kevin ambao ni sana 0 centigrade and the standard pressure is 1 atm ambayo ni sawa na 170 mm fg at standard temperature and pressure we find experimentally that one mole of any gas occupy a volume of ko volume ya gas at standard temperature and pressure ilionekana kuwa sawa sawa na 22.4 liters audm cube and 22.4 dm cube ina, inakuwa named as gmv So one mole at STP inakuwa ina 22.4 dm cube one mole at STP So molar gas volume is the volume of one mole of a gas occupied at standard temperature and pressure occupied at standard temperature and pressure that is molar gas volume volume of one gas volume of one mole of a gas occupied at standard temperature and, and pressure now let's see the idea of ideal gas equation 
ideal guess equation. Our ideal guess equation is found by combining three guess laws. Boaz, Charles, and Avogadro's. Avogadro's. So, according to Boaz, we said, according to Boaz, we said uh, V is inverse for two. Volume is inverse to pressure. Charles, uh, according to Charles, we said V is that proportional to temperature. And according to Avogadro's, Avogadro's, we say the V is the proportion to number of moles. So you see, combining these three, we'll get V is the proportion to number of moles, temperature divided by pressure. Uh, removing the proportionate sign, you will get V is equal to R N T divided by pressure P. So V is equal to N R T divided by P. Uh, e to Kizdisha Kutavata VP is equal to N R T. Here, Pajinake equation here, Pandanitwa, ideal, ideal guess equation. Sasa, upper E constant R, E constant R in a value yake, constant R. Constant R is called universal, universal. Molar gas constant. Molar gas constant. Kwa lazima unajua kwamba R ni nini? R ni universal molar gas constant. Na ina value yake kabisa na tunaenda kuona sio muda jinsi gani ambavyo tunaweza kupata value hiyo universal molar gas constant R. Tunaenda kuona hapo sio muda jinsi gani ambavyo tunaweza kupata. Kwa hiyo unaona unakuja kupata equation kama hii hapa ambayo ndio inaitwa ideal gas equation. Kwa hiyo kama number of moles is equal to 1 if number of moles is equal to 1 from vp is equal to nrt which is a delegacy equation if number of moles is equal to 1 vp becomes equal to rt kama number of moles against ni sana 1 so the equation above is called a delegacy equation the ideal guess equation hold fairly accurate for all guesses at low temperature at low temperature uh, we shall discuss later why does it hold only at low temperature because at high temperature different gases they have they vary in the uh, parameters and the variation of the parameters of gases at high temperature causes them to to behave differently so ideal gas equation is also known as the equation of states for a gas because it contains all variables temperature pressure volume and the number of moles. So sometimes we call it the equation of states, which describes completely the condition or state of any gas sample. Uh, if we have three variables of these, the fourth variable can be calculated from the equation. If we have three variables, Katia is about to the volume, pressure, and temperature. Number of moles is also calculated. So this R is known. So I told you that R is known as universal molar gas constant. R is known as universal molar gas constant. So let's see how do we calculate the numerical value of R. Numerical value of R. Universal molar gas constant PV is equal to NRT. Now making the subject R, we'll get R is equal to PV is equal to R. Uh, sorry, is equal to nt. R will be is equal to PV divided by nt. Now, is called the universal molar gas constant. We calculate this value at STP. At STP. So we know at STP, volume of one mole of the gas is equal to shinambiri point in dm cube. A number of moles up to merit you ngapi. One at STP. Again at STP pressure is equal to one atm, and STP temperature ni sana ngapi? Temperature at STP ni mbili sabina tatu Kevin. So tunapatia value universal molar gas constant. 
ni kuingiza tu hizo hizo namba kwenye kwenye calculator kwenye calculator 273 one ATM alafu number of moles ambayo ni one mole na volume ambayo ni 22.4 22.4 sasa tunachotakiwa tu kujua ni kwamba kuziweka hizo nani ziwe zinafanana kuziweka hizo units ziwe zinafanana kwa mfano uh, ukitaka kukalculate kwa kutumia unit ya ATM hii volume itaacha kwenye DM cube kwa hiyo kesi 1 kesi 1 ni tunatumia newton per meter square au unit ya pascals na volume lazima iwe meter cubic kwa hiyo maana yake hapa itakuwa ni 22.4 times 10 power negative 3 meter cubic hiyo ndio itakuwa volume yetu so from there utakuja kupata r ni sawa sawa na pressure itakuwa ni 101325 uh, newton per meter square times 22.4 times 10 power negative 3 meter cubic then divided by 1 mole times 273 kevin then hapo utakuja kupata ni 8.314 joule pa hiyo hapo kilo mole hii ni kevin then mole hiyo ni value ya universal molar gas constant kama utatumia meter cubic lakini case 2 ni kama pressure iko kwenye atm pressure ikiwa kwenye atm na volume ikiwa kwenye dm cube utakuja kupata r ni sawa sawa na 1 atm times 22.4 dm cubic divided by 1 mole times 273 k utakuja kupata ni 0.0821 atm dm cubic mol universe kevin universe so we have two values of universal molar gas constant na kwenye mitiani always you are given this universal molar gas constant so there is no need to memorize it because you are always provided with them in the exams so in this period i am ending here in the next period we will start discussing about the universal gas law universal gas law or ideal gas law Uh, the idea of the ideal gas law relates with the ideal gas equation but we will discuss it in the next period thank you everybody subscribe to the channel like this video and share it to your friends in your in your social medias so as to get these periods of physical chemistry for free thank you everybody wish you nice studies